now to our weekly segment, TikTok, where we take a closer look at the story behind the sensation. Searching for edgy bedroom decor or just want a conversation starter for your living room? Our next guest may have just what you're looking for. Austin Molno, best known as The Sign Guy, has racked up more than 4 million viewers who love watching him create custom vinyl street signs. Austin, welcome to the show. We're glad to have you. Some Thank people, you so much. Glad to be here. Well, your studio looks cool, too. We'll talk about that in a minute. But some people make a living creating T-shirts or jewelry. You make street signs. How did you get started in this business? Man, I mean, I guess it started a long time ago. Um, my first days in the sign shop here was when I was 12 years old. It's actually a family business. I've been working here my whole life. I worked through high school. I was working through college and then COVID hit. And when COVID hit, just like everybody else, couldn't go to work, couldn't go to school. So I was stuck in my house. And during this time, um, I noticed TikTok started blowing up. And I had a few friends who had told me, Austin, you should try TikTok, man. Like, I think you'd be good at it. So I just, I kind of dabbled with it in my house during COVID um, and was able to get 15,000 followers just from my house. And then when I was able to go back to work, the first thing I did was I made a sign video and that video got a couple million views. And I was like, okay, maybe we should try that again. So I do it again. And then it got 18 million views. And after that one, I had to go to my dad. I'm like, dude, we have a whole new marketplace here, you know, like, the only signs that we had done were standard city signs, and I was noticing thousands of comments of people asking for custom signs. Yeah, so you I have a lot of requests. And, oh, yeah. Um, so, so I went to my dad, and we, we put together a website where people can customize and order their own signs. So we only get to see short clips of your creative process online, but on average, we have to know how long does it take you to make a sign? <laughs> I get this question all the time. Um, my recording probably takes me about two hours, and depending on the video, editing is another two hours. So we're looking at four to five hours on average per sign. Okay. ASMR, and I've heard some of the sounds, has grown really quickly into a phenomenon. So for those who don't know, it's designed as or defined as people pleasing sounds, I guess some call it oddly satisfying, and many of your videos follow this trend. We just want to show our viewers an example. Street sign ASMR. So the noise does give you the positive kind of goosebumps, which is uh, exactly the point, but why did you decide to incorporate this into your videos? I, I mean, I had no idea about ASMR. I had no idea that making signs was satisfying. I've been doing this my whole entire life. So once I started posting these videos, I started seeing comments of people saying, wow, it's so satisfying. The noises are so nice. So I went out and I bought a microphone and now I do full ASMR style videos and, and people love it. Um, they love um, the noises that the sign makes. And then also like depending on the shape of the sign, some signs I wiggle. Yeah. We heard my videos it. and people seem to love that. But I've been hearing it my whole life. So it, it was all just normal for me. So I have to ask you this. Scrolling through your content, there's a lot of outlandish requests. There's life-size yeah. eggplant <laughs> emoji, a giant Uno yeah. card. Give us <laughs> one order you're never going to forget. Oh, man. I mean, so many of the orders I probably shouldn't talk about. Um, <laughs> But I guess like my favorite sign that I've made was for the NFL. Um, I did a video for them. Uh, it was a promotional video for the kickoff game. That was pretty cool. And then I also got to deliver signs to P. Diddy's house for his children, which was pretty sweet. Very cool. Very cool. OK, so getting back to your production shop, could you show us a quick demo on how you make these incredible signs? Of course. A demo. So I already sheeted the blank. This is the reflective vinyl. And then the next step would be applying the, the cut vinyl onto the reflective material. Everybody asks me how I line it up so good in my videos. But as you see, I sit here for a couple seconds and make sure everything's all straight. So we apply one side first, 
and we roll it on and that way we know the rest of the sign it's not going to move at all it's going to stay on straight okay and then brush off all the dust make sure it's good and then we peel off the backing and you got to make sure everything's peeling off good and then you roll it on after this this is called transfer tape because it transferred the black vinyl onto the orange sign sure you just tear off the transfer tape Nice. There you go. Yeah, right. well done. Very cool. And a little <laughs> ASMR to boot. Austin, thank you so much. We really appreciate it. And of course, you can check out more of Austin's custom designs under the handle at the sign guy. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.